Injuries can happen out of nowhere. Blindsided in a car accident, overuse while playing a sport, a slip and tumble when walking. Depending on the damage, if pain becomes intolerable and chronic, the victim may be robbed of sleep, physical activity, full employment, and the ability to function normally. Finding relief from the agony of pain can take years of trial and error. Often the most common treatments may have unwanted consequences. A common treatment for pain is narcotic uh, medication. Uh, unfortunately, these medications can be overprescribed. Uh, patients on pain medication should be seeing uh, a pain uh, management uh, doctor. Uh, unfortunately, patients aren't always able to tell whether they're seeing a appropriately trained physician or a pill mill doctor. There are some strong narcotic medications out there like Oxycontin which are being overprescribed. Patients can become uh, hooked on these medications uh, and the cure becomes an addiction. Another traditional option for relief of intense chronic pain is surgery. Because it is invasive, expensive, involves downtime, and comes without a guarantee, this is often the choice of last resort. People choose surgery as a last resort because they've tried non-operative treatments such as medications, injections, physical therapy, and limitation of activity. Sometimes people's activity is limited so much by pain or weakness that they really can't live with it anymore and they choose surgery. The only times that people are not good surgical candidates are when they have such bad lung or heart problems that it would be far too risky to undergo anesthetic for an operation. A lesser known approach to treating severe pain involves a combination of traditional and non-invasive cutting edge techniques. Called conservative interventional medicine, doctors specializing in pain management are having encouraging results with this method. Conservative interventional treatments uh, are the best uh, treatments uh, in order to avoid a narcotic use uh, and surgery and to uh, decrease pain and increase function. These treatments uh, include uh, osteopathic manipulation, uh, physical therapy, uh, non-narcotic medication, uh, non-steroidal compounded creams, uh, patient education such as proper posture and biomechanics, uh, as well as nerve blocks and trigger point injections. Successful pain specialists are like detectives. They track down the source of pain using clues from a patient's history, physical exam, imaging, and distinct pain patterns. One such conservative interventional pain specialist is Dr. William Cole, Jr. at OrthoMed Pain and Sports Medicine in Sarasota, Florida. Dr. Cole and his associates find and seek the exact pain generators to target the placement of specific medicines into the source. Pain decreases and function increases, often within minutes. People are like cars. If you do regular maintenance, the parts will last longer as opposed to having to replace them. So it's much more important to do maintenance through the interventional procedures. That way we can decrease the pain, increase the function, and decrease the surgery and the medications. And one intervention is when we do replacement of the knee fluid, like changing the oil in a car. Uh, first, we have to use ultra-sterile technique, which is very important uh, to avoid any type of bacteria or infection. Next, we have to identify the actual area that the joint is located. You normally find that by the indentation and right here, picture, and picture. And that would be right here. We're going to freeze the skin to decrease the amount of discomfort a little bit higher. And then there's a pinch. This is the lidocaine to numb it. Perfect. And you can see how it's flowing within the joint space. Slightly aspirate the joint to ensure the placement. would put the synvisc, which is the hyaluronic acid to replace the fluid of the knee joint. We clean it with ultra-sterile technique and we're finished. I had extreme, extreme pain on my right knee and due to an arthritic condition that I have, came to Dr. Cole who offered me the injections, synvisc injections, because of the relief that it would give me for over a year and I decided to go with that modality of treatment instead of going with the modality of treatment of oral medications, 
which have side effects, and surgery, which has a long recuperation time. According to the National Institutes of Health, one of the most common reasons adults visit doctors is low back pain. Nearly 100% of adults will experience back pain in their lives. Ultrasound guided injections for sciatica, fluoroscopic spine injections, radiofrequency ablation, plasma rich protein. These are some advanced interventional pain management techniques. Customized for acute, chronic, and cancer pain, these and other conservative treatments do not require surgical steel or a bucket of narcotics. People don't have to live with pain anymore and they need to know what their options are to help them heal. Um, you don't have to go to just surgery or drugs. I designed and created this solved system, which is the system of osteopathic learning for valid and effective diagnosis and treatment to focus on the pain and the treatment options after specific identification of them. Whether from a defect, injury, illness, or aging, Physical pain can bring its victims to their knees. Specialists who find and fix pain without drugs or knives offer a leg up to their patients. I can always find the pain. The most conservative treatment is always the best to minimize narcotics and knives. The goal is simple, decrease the pain, increase the function, and if it's not gonna make your life better, I am not gonna waste your time. By finding the exact pain generators, we can customize a treatment plan so that you can decrease the pain, increase the function. And when you have multiple areas of pain, you can peel off the layers like an onion for increased independence and quality of life. For more information, call 941-371-7171 and visit nopain.com.